Okay, so let me see how fast I can do this. So they're asking us to evaluate this to get the value. So the first thing is to use the logarithm rule that says that if I have log x base y, I can actually separate them in two logarithms, like x base maybe 10 or whatever, all over log y. The only thing is that both of them must be in the same base. Okay, so that means I can write this as the integral of uh, log x base e all over, and then I will write this as uh, log 10 base e, okay, and that is in the x. So what is this going to give me? This is the same thing as the integral of, uh, remember that whenever you have log to base e, that's also what we call ln. So this is uh, ln x all over ln 10. Okay, so, and we are integrating with respect to x. Recall that uh, uh, the ln 10 is a constant, so I can bring it out of the integral as 1 over ln 10 into the integral of ln x with respect to x. And uh, up here, I already integrated ln x as x ln x minus x plus c. You can see the video on that. Therefore, this is actually equal to 1 all over ln 10 multiplied by x ln x minus x plus c. And that is the solution to this problem.